adage espoused by Dr. James Quedri Agui that if you educate a man, you educate an individual, but if you educate a woman, you educate a whole nation, perhaps had only education in mind. But for the First Lady Rebecca Ekufuado, this adage also applies in the area of commerce. This is the reason she came up with the Terima Initiative, which is about supporting women to improve their economic status. We all know that women are the backbone of the family. Once a woman is working or trading or whatever, will take care of her family. From across the country, Mrs. Ekufuado has met hundreds of women and provided them startup packages ranging from small tools, equipment and small grants to boost their businesses. Theresa Jama, who is a mother of five and hails from Abisim in the Bono region, is one of the beneficiaries of the Tarima Initiative. These are tools Teresa had for many years been struggling to save some money to buy. The whole idea of the Terima initiative is for beneficiaries to also extend a helping hand to others. The First Lady and her team carefully assess the needs of these women and provide them with that life-changing support. In Cape Coast, this fishmonger and Gary Seller, Joyce Azuma, talks about the support she received from Mrs. Ekufuado. Ah, uh, present in you know, or Beno, I mean, they are mama fridge. Mama, my phone, water ton, ice water, ice cream, and uh, uh, ice cake, and I didn't see. Muswama, many on work a cafe, Musum. Mrs. Rebecca Ekufado's Tarima initiative is not biased towards a particular age group. The young and the old all have smiles on their faces as a result of the support she offers them. This old lady, AC Nana Arthur, for example, was not left out. She is also a fishmonger. Guys, AC Nana Arthur and her family say they will forever remain grateful to the First Lady for the support. It's a during um, the 2016 campaign in one of the markets somebody brought it up that uh, you know I should try and do something about uh, a crash for for the mothers who bring their children along to the markets to sell, especially the Kayaye. And I promised to do that. And so we started building creches where the mothers can leave their babies all day long while they do their work in the markets. And the children will be taken care of uh, in the creches. There are beautiful creches coming up. We've just started building them. The children too are going to benefit greatly. They're going to be taught and uh, looked after and trained. I'll carry on and do the best I can. I will always help women and, uh, and children.